Lori Popal here. Today we're going to work on a new project. I'm going to show you some alternative egg holders you can use to display your egg artwork. Inexpensive plastic or acrylic ones are nice and readily available from places like Amazon, but when you get to the larger ones for ostrich eggs, they are quite expensive and sometimes harder to find. I'm going to show you two very inexpensive options. The plastic inside from a roll of scotch tape or cut pieces from the inside of a paper towel roll. Another option consists of using napkin rings, which come in so many very pretty styles. And this one, believe it or not, is just a cabinet knob placed upside down. And these two are candle holders. Small votive candle or tea light holders work great for displaying eggs. Shot glasses are also a very quick way of displaying your egg. For ostrich egg holders, bangle bracelets work great. They come in a variety of styles and materials and you can easily find them in costume jewelry stores or even dollar stores. You can combine several of the bracelets together and glue them with stronger glue like E6000 to form really nice stands. Another option is to make egg stands out of eggs themselves. These particular stands were made out of chicken eggs. You can dye and wax them in the Ukrainian style or just paint them and add elements like beads and gold trim. First measure out the size of the stand and then using a Dremel just cut along the lines. Once you have your egg piece cut out, trace around the edge of this piece on an index card or cardstock. Next, cut out the circle. Glue this card on the inside of the eggshell to form the base. To further reinforce it, apply epoxy to the inside of the shell with an inexpensive paintbrush. Now, take some perm paper or tissue paper or cigarette rolling paper. You can make a nice clean circle or just push some of it directly into the wet epoxy. This will help straighten the shell. And here is a finished eggshell stand supporting another chicken egg. If you ever work with emu shells, sometimes you might find a damaged egg that just won't work right for etching. In this case, you can slice off the bottom of the egg with your Dremel, glue the cardstock as the base, and use epoxy and tissue paper inside to straighten this emu holder. The one on the left has just a normal slice emu shell holder. For the one on the right, I etched an additional emu eggshell. As you can see from the inside view, I sliced it, reinforced it, and used it as a base for the other etched emu eggshell. And here is my finished etched emu with its etched emu base. By the way, be sure to check out my etched emu video for a step-by-step -step tutorial. Thanks for watching my videos. Please subscribe to my channel to get updates of new videos. Visit my website at lauripopal.com. Hugs!